Hello, boys and girls. Welcome back to some more Stellaris. Today, we have uh, finished... Hold on. Speaking of research, we have finished researching uh, battleships. Um, let's go with hyper shields. Get ourselves some really good defenses going here. We'll research that. Um, we have finished researching the uh, Spaceport 6 upgrade, and that gave us battleships. So guess what's in the queue now? Le Battleship. Um... So, let's go ahead and actually cancel that out, because now we can upgrade this to advanced shields. And actually, if we put just a regular shield there, and a regular shield there, there we go. Now we have enough power. Sweet. So, we'll save that for now. Now we can build two battleships here, two here, two here and to here we're gonna have a hell of a fleet uh let's actually let's take stock right now we are the fifth most powerful empire uh everybody is kind of superior to us in terms of naval equality um however <laughs> let's see how that changes once we finish our mass production <laughs> of, <laughs> of battleships um let's go ahead and just research that that's like a quick research that won't take long um, my goal today is to try to go to war with the Natroxy state. I want to take over some of their territory. And with my fucking battleship production at the level that it's at right now, I think that's definitely possible. Um, definitely possible. <clears throat> I'm going to be cranking out ships like a fucking motherfucker. Just give me a second, and I'm going to be fucking... I'm going to be powerful as fuck. I'm really curious to what, as to what my rank... How, how much my ranking jumps up in power once I finish all those. Uh, what the fuck just happened there? Did something just change there? I don't know what it was, but something changed. Huh, okay. Oh, it changed the name. It was the Natroxy something else, and now it's the Natroxy Polity. Who the fuck is this? I don't know who this is. No. Fuck you. <laughs> I say no, sir. Um... We're losing credits, though, because we have so many battleships. Hmm. Let's go find ourselves one of our allies here. We have plenty of minerals. Let's see. Let's communicate with them. Let's offer a trade deal. Let's offer... Minerals for energy credits. So, if we offer... How many until they completely rule it out of the question? Let's go 55. There we go. Confirm. Damn, somebody just joined their, uh... Research complete. Their, uh, their confederation. Complete. Interesting. Shit, I didn't want to do that. Um... Naval capacity, we need that. Now, alright, so all those have now completed construction. Let's look at our power rankings now. <laughs> we are up to fourth, and people are now equivalent, not superior to us. So, we now just need to wait and keep on constructing battleships. Why are we... Why did we just lose minerals there? That's weird. Uh, we just need to wait for enough minerals to come in for us to start building more battleships. And, like I said, I would like to go to war with the Natroxy state this during this video. Or maybe we go to war with somebody else. Let's, look, let's take a look at the power rankings here. Who is fairly pathetic? 
that we can pick on. Shit, all these people are the auspicious league. Like, half the damn galaxy is in this fucking confederacy. Ooh. Oh, this guy's a fucking... Oh, damn. Dude. This fucking mandate of chicken naff vassalized this guy. There's literally, like, nobody I can fight that is not a vassal or isn't a member of the Auspicious League. The only ones I can do that are these two. The Troxy State and Independent Think Like Confederacy. Those are the only two that I can go to war with and not have any repercussions. But, to be fair, if I go to war with them and take over all their territory, I'm going to be a pretty fucking massive empire myself. And quite honestly, at that point, let me look here. Actually, you know what? That's really, that, that confederacy, it's really not that big. You look at it, it's this guy right here, the brown dude, this blue, and then these two right in here, and this guy, and then this guy. It's not, they don't have that much. Quite honestly, if I can take over one of these two, and then take over the other and have like this entire like third or fourth of the galaxy I might be able to take on that confederacy and then save the mandate of chicken F for last hmm in the meantime let's go ahead and do engineering facility 3 that way we can unlock more uh, research capabilities Hmm. I'm really intrigued as to if I could win a war with them, with with these guys right here. I wonder if they would join me. They might join me. If I get them to join, I would definitely win. Well, let's just keep on building battleships at this point. Yeah, they may be willing to. So, if I could get them to join the war... Theoretically, I could take them over and then just turn around, backstab them, and take over their shit too. Interesting. Very, very interesting. Damn, this guy's massive, though. Look at this shit. This guy's huge. Absolutely ginormous. Actually, you know what would be really fun is if I did a... If, if you could somehow do, like, a small galaxy like this, but have, like, 30 empires in here so basically like every star system has its own starting empire and then you just all fight it out that'd be fun i just thought about that that actually be pretty interesting um but let's see is there anything we can upgrade we can upgrade all of our power plants we can upgrade that we can upgrade all this so much for me saving up minerals to uh, upgrade <laughs> uh, or to build uh, battleships with oh well, you gotta spend money to make money right yeah but we have a 10.4 K power fleet now we're actually above them in the power rankings now we're actually third in the power rankings if we were to get this dude to join in we would win the war definitely Hmm. By the end of this, I think I'm going to go to war with them. I'm going to build, like... I think if I build, like, maybe five more battleships, that should be good. Are they still overwhelming? No, they're just now flat-out superior to me in fleet power. That's good. 
That means they're not too far ahead of me. So actually, this is going very, very well. Very well. Let's look at our research. None of it is really close. Um, hmm. I think what I might do is I might do a jump cut here, and I will be back once I am a little bit closer to going to war with the Netroxy state. So, uh, BRB. Welcome back, everyone. Now, I have a bit of a dilemma here because a bit, a bit of a, a bit of a dilemma here. Um, I wanted to win this game by conquering. However, follow me on this one. My most highest opinion of me person, right here. I go to communicate with them to make a trade deal to get more energy credits. I go look, oh, maybe I can ask to join their confederation. I'm at negative 36. My differing war philosophy makes me negative 50. If I change that, I might be able to get into their confederation. Let me... Where do, where's the war philosophy thing now? Uh, policies. Aha. War philosophy. Liberation wars. Yes. So now, let's unpause this. And now, let's look. Can we join the Auspicious League? Hold on. Let's look. We need to research something. I'm interested if I can actually join their federation. Um, in the meantime, let's go ahead and research that. He has to consult his allies. Okay. Okay, cool. He's breaking our... Oh, shit. Do we make it in? Okay, hold on. Let's research this. Are we in the auspicious league? Haha, -ha, I think we did. We are. We're in the Auspicious League. I actually hold on. Are we on there? Yes, we are. Sweet. So now we are part of the fucking half of the galaxy that is in the Auspicious League. Very, very nice. So let us now that we are a part of the Auspicious League, let us go to war. With the Natroxy state. Is this an alliance or is this an actual federation? I think this is an actual federation, right? Yeah, it's a federation. Cool. So. Human planets wish to declare war against the... Ooh. Ooh, I like. Let's vote yes. Liberate them. Okay, so let's send our ships in. So now we are part of a federation. Now we can get a federation win. This is going to be interesting. I didn't plan on this, but this is actually very intriguing. Um, let's go ahead. Before we do that, let's communicate with these dudes. Offer a trade deal. Research agreement for energy credits. And a research agreement? No. That's a shitty deal. Can we do research? No, fuck you. What are we allies for? Hmm. Okay, well, let's just unpause this then. And let it run. Uh, in the meantime, we can upgrade that. Hostile fleet detected. Ooh. Hostile fleets, huh? Hostile fleet detected. Let's send my fleet up here. Shall we? All right, so we're actually we're actually a part of like a huge alliance. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Stations under attack. Where? Where is my station under attack? Hold on. Oh, it's oh, they're invading me. 
Screw you, man. Here comes my fleet, bitch. You're gonna get fucked, dude. Oh, here they come. Here's gonna be the battle. Oh, no, they aren't running away. I know they're not running away. Situation Fight them! Go, Situation boys! Log, Go after them! Station under attack. Stations under attack? Where? Bastards, they're doing hit and run on me. So we just gotta start cranking out more battleships. Oh shit. Oh shit. Get them boys! Fight! Fight them! Our battleships are doing fine, though. I'm not really worried about this fight. Our battleships are hanging in there. This is actually really cool. I've never been a part of a Federation in a game before. I've always wondered what it was like, but I never was able to be in one. And now I feel special. Yeah, they're done for. Time for me to get my fleet in orbit over here, and we're going to bombard them. Research complete. Ooh, research speed. Nice. Damn, 50%. Plus 50%. That's crazy. Um, I really wish we had the upgraded uh, energy power cell thing. Good to... Situation log updated. Let's just do this. Alright, so let's go over here and just fight them. Hostile fleet engaged. Hostile fleet engaged. Where are my allies at? Are they not fighting them or Oh, okay, there they are. They're fighting them. Okay. That's good. Fight them, buddies. I'll get this front, you get that front. So they need to seed Bors. Where's Bors? Oh, that's what they're demanding. Um, we are demanding liberate human hegemony. Ah, and then liberate Nitraxia. Interesting. Let's get this research going. Um, explosive weapon attack speed. We could do that. I think we just do that. So let's send our fleets into Traxia. Actually, let's. Actually, yeah, we're good. Let's send our fleet in here. Oh, they're ready for us. They're waiting. With their construction ships and their science ships. I'm scared. Hostile fleet engaged. Situation log updated. Hostile fleet engaged. Hostile fleet engaged. A Federation battleship. Hostile fleet engaged. Situation log updated. Hostile fleet engaged. There's a Federation battleship. It costs more, so I'm assuming it's better. Hostile fleet engaged. 
Situation log updated. It has less shields. But more damage. Shit, let's play let's get one of them. Situation log updated. Construction complete. Situation log updated. Fleet engaged. Situation log updated. Situation log updated. Alright, so let's Fleet engaged. Let us go here and we will uh research box in that systems, then we'll send our armies in here. So let's have all these merge, and let's just have you bombard this planet. How many armies do they have on here? They have quite a few. I don't know if my armies are going to be able to uh, defeat them. Hopefully they will. Aha, that's what we needed right there. That one right, yeah. Okay. guy keeps on making armies and then and then sending them out Construction complete. which is annoying because my my fleet stops sieging or bombarding every time one of their armies comes out This is controlled by the Federation. Interesting. I don't like that. <laughs> Wait, how do we know the Federation's leaders are? I'm the Federation president? What the fuck? Next president is the humans. It's a hell of a looking thing, isn't it? I think I'll just keep building for my own fleet. How about that? So, let's go ahead. And build battleships. Alright, now I can land my armies. Take over their planet, hopefully. Yep. They're crumbling. Bow to my power. Let's go ahead and send you down here. Research complete. Aha. Ooh, we'll get that one too. Let's send you in here. And let's send you down here. They're going to attack my transport fleets. No, you bastards. Get away from them. Sucks to be you, nerd. Situation log updated. Construction complete. Hostile fleet engaged. Hostile fleet engaged. Damn, our fucking federation is just massive. They keep on sending in fleets. This is crazy. 
I think I'm just gonna keep this ship here then. If they're just gonna keep on sending in. Uh, let's actually send you here. I'm gonna take out their, uh, their f oh shit, that's not their frontier outpost. Okay, never mind. It's another frontier outpost. Let's send, all right, yeah, let's send you in to merge. Are they seriously not forfeiting yet? Dude, you got beat. Holy shit, look at the size of that fleet. <laughs> I'm glad I didn't go to war with the Federation and instead I joined them. Our Federation is massive though. Like, this is gonna be a good fight when our Federation goes against the Mandate of Chikunov. Or Chikunov, or whatever the fuck the name is. Let's look at the relative power rankings. Yeah, like, it's all the, like, other than this dude. Everybody else is a member of our league that are like the major powers. So this should be an interesting fight. Construction complete. They have no planets left. I don't know what they're waiting on. Situation log Actually, let's merge. Maybe. Just maybe. Research you know how bad it is? I know, because our Federation ships are down there too. Hmm. Let's send our ships in here and destroy it. Let's just start Research wrecking their shit. How about that? Research is done. Nav capacity increased. Nice. Let's go Hydroponics Farm 3. And... Battleship Assembly Yards is key. Let's just send our ships around until they decide to forfeit. Yeah, this dude fucked up. He's surrounded by the entire Federation and he's rivals with every single one of them. L literally, like, this guy's a member of our Federation. This guy's a member. I am now. The humans are. The people in here are. Like, he's literally surrounded by us. <laughs> There's no way he was winning this. Let me send you to defeat that. And then... Is there anything in this system that's... No? They literally have nothing. They're, near, they're not... Forfeiting. Maybe this will help? we kill the research station no if we defeat them I might get some of this territory on the border too That could also be a benefit. Do they have anything left? Like, why are they not forfeiting? Let's send our people down there. Maybe they have... Maybe they built something down here. Do I have anything... Whoa. Hostile fleet engaged. Where? Aha! I found the rest of them. If we defeat these two, there we go. Hey, and like I said, now that's in our territory. Sweet. We've won. Whoa. Independence guaranteed. 
Oh, the, the for the new empire. Ah, decline. Fuck you, dude. So, now, let's have all these dudes just go... Ah, they're fine where they are, actually. Let's have you repair and have you... You can just stay there for now. And then... Oh, I guess we can unpause that. And then have my fleet... Where's my where's my armies? There they are. Let's have them merge. And then go to heal up. Yes. The more the merrier. And then, do you want to check? Uh, they're still they're still pretty mad at us. Okay, but we did get more land, so we can now colonize that planet. Very nice. So actually, I think I'm gonna stop this episode here. Uh, very eventful episode. I did not expect to be joining the Federation today. Um, that was quite unexpected. Um, but I'm glad I did because now we are in. The driver's seat in this playthrough um, the only thing that can stop is really is this guy right here um, but if we take out the rest of the galaxy first and then take on him at the end we should be able to beat him no problem so we're looking pretty good right now um, thank you guys let's pause this for a second sure let's invite them Research complete. Incoming transmission. They joined the Auspicious League. Hydroponics farm. Nice. Let's research this. Um, but anyway, yeah, so we joined the Federation. We went to war for the first time. We kicked ass. Um, and so we're looking pretty, pretty good here. Uh, I'm pretty happy with it. And... Uh, We'll see how this progresses, but uh, thank you guys for watching this part of Solaris. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like, subscribe to the channel for more Solaris videos, leave some feedback in the comment section down below, and I'll see you guys next time.